It's race day, baby. It's race day, baby. Oh, oh shoot, you okay? <sighs> What's up, YouTube? It's race day. This is race number four on the season. Today we're out here in Olympia, Washington at North Slope Trails, which is in the Capitol Forest. Stoked for this one. Last year, this was the finale, um, but I did pretty well last year. It's looking like it's gonna be a long day. Um, I think around 20 miles and 5,000 plus feet of climbing, so legs are gonna be toast by the end of this one. Thanks for watching, and here we go.
Oh my gosh. That guy wasn't kidding, that was soft. Soft, squishy dirt. Oh shoot, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. You okay? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, Doc. <laughs> Taking feet off all over the place. Oh my gosh. These corners are so soft. Into a dead stop in a tree. Did you? That upper so, section was so, so it's soft, man. Unrideable now. Like, yeah. you won't ride yeah. that again this season. It was way better yesterday. That Take a couple, man. Thanks, Doug. Oh, it feels one's good. good. One's good. Five, four, three, two, one, send it. So fast, holy crap. Holy shit. I'm 
firm bucked me. Ready? Three, two, one.
slow. Well, we survived the day. It was brutal. Man, the trails are so sick here. So sick. Come check out the trails here. A lot of them are easily shuttleable. Is that a word? You can shuttle them if you're not into climbing. Um, a lot of these fire roads are pretty steep climbs anyways. So. so yeah, a little bit of a climb back up to the staging area and we'll see how we did. Thank you. Awesome. It's the end of a long day. And this burrito, I don't know if there's anything else better in the world at the moment. Well, I'm beat. That was a long day. Uh, ended up being a little over 20 miles and 5,500 feet of climbing. Brutal. Um, surprisingly, it didn't feel as bad as uh, the Tiger Mountain race. I think just because that one I was covered in mud. That one was just rough, but um, I think I ended up uh, seventh or eighth. Um, still a couple guys who haven't turned in the time chips, so we'll see. But if I stay seventh or eighth, I'm stoked on that. I One of my goals this season was to crack the top 10 in one of the races. My first year in the expert category, uh, to have a top 10 finish means a lot to me. It's, uh, yeah, something I've been working really hard for. So, um, good day on the bike, no crashes. A um, couple small mistakes, but nothing that really cost me much time. And that's sort of been my approach this year. Just ride smooth, don't make big mistakes. Um, and that's landed me, you know, consistently in the top half of the group. Every race, it seems like I'm getting a little bit better. And that's enough for me. That's what I'm shooting for. So thanks, guys, so much for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one.